What's up guys, I am back, so Vic here of Use Market Biz, bringing you the latest updates on cryptocurrencies and with that being said, well, let's begin. So here is the website, preferredcurrency.news, where you can subscribe to get the newsletter that will notify you of the latest updates on cryptocurrencies and also you will receive there the spreadsheet of Don the Guru so Don the Guru is the publisher of this um, newsletter okay so guys this is only $15 a month or $180 a year and if you want to um, explore further then please do watch my previous video where I focus on the newsletter updates okay so guys um let's proceed to the news update today so this is the news update today okay so we got the news update here at this website pcn.today our preferred currency news okay so here is the news update so monitor bitcoin cash development with the coin dance tracking page okay so cryptocurrency data website coindance revealed on friday the team's revamped bitcoin cash protocol development tracking page show okay so interested proponents can get a comprehensive look at all the completed bch developments proposals ideas that are being discussed and concepts that are currently under development okay so um coindance bitcoin cash protocol development tracking page so the analytical website CoinDance has added a lot more detail, detail to the site development section. The Bitcoin Cash Protocol developed tracking page expands upon a list of the development discussions, proposals, and code that's being developed right now. Okay, for example, there are currently 12 featured concepts under development by the groups of developers who help the BCH protocol prosper. Right, so developers from groups like the Cash shuffle developers bitcoin abc and bitcoin unlimited or bu have all contributed to the maturing ideas okay so here's um the screenshot of the coin dance right protocol here it is bch protocol development under discussion here it is all right so According to CoinDesk statistics, the 12 features under development include UTXO, commitments modified, fee structure enables snore signatures, reinstate more upcodes and compact blocks, graphene version 2, and more. The website, is data, uh, the website data describes what the feature does, like how graphene version 2 adds a lot more functionality to the first graphene phase. Okay? So open cap here is this open cap and this protocol maximum max block size based on medium block size bch protocol development under discussion so in another instance the coin dance, dance documentation described bitcoin unlimited's compact blocks protocol supporting cb in bu would strengthen the connections between the bu peer, peers and the rest of the network without having to rely on intermediates explains the bch development tracking page additionally the site gives users a link to where they can read up on more additional i mean more information specifically tied to each concept okay so optimization privacy scaling and whether or not it's backward compatible okay so the tracking page also details there are 14 bitcoin cash protocol developments under discussion this means bch programmers have merely conversed about the idea but no one in particular is developing the specific concept all right so we? features being discussed include bobtail one-way aggregate signatures representative tokens or group avalanche bls signatures and more all right so all the features that coin dance has listed whether they are being discussed or under development explain the underlying purpose of each improvement as well each concept has a little icon on the top left corner oh top oh, here it is is an icon 
um, on the window frame and the pop up window it details the, the features intention a fingerprint icon says the purpose of this proposal is to improve security other icons include usability extensibility optimization privacy and scaling moreover icons on the upper right explain if the concept is not backward compatible okay so if anyone is interested in what is going on with bitcoin cash development then they will likely appreciate the development tracking page okay so coindan still has its other sections of data sets which include the bch protocols nodes so blocks mind hash rate politics opinion mining profitability and a section where bch users can create vanity addresses in the bitcoin cash protocol development section enthusiasts and researchers can also see completed progress that happened during prior updates okay so guys um you can monitor the bitcoin cash development uh, with the coin dance, dance tracking page and let's check uh, where the link all right coin dance oh, here it is the tracking page of the bitcoin cash in coin dance here it is so cash.coin.dance slash development so here are um the development of the bitcoin cash proposals okay so here it is the purpose of this proposal this is the uh icon that was discussed earlier so all you have to do is just hover it right so the purpose of this proposal is to improve usability this one the purpose of the uh, this proposal is to improve extensibility and of course usability okay so here are the uh, uh, protocols all right so you can monitor it in going dance now okay so guys that is the first update of the day or or in this video so let's continue so this is the second update that I'm going to um, share with you. So it's called Switzerland to relax laws to accommodate blockchain and cryptocurrency startups. So this is very, very nice since more and more countries are adapting to, to blockchain development and especially Switzerland. As we all know, Swiss Switzerland is always supporting cryptocurrency. All right so um the swiss government has announced a new legislative approach to blockchain regulation in an official report the document recognizes that technology is one of the most important recent developments for the financial sector in simulating the country's economy so i told you switzerland is very happy with cryptocurrency all right so a swiss innovation paradise so according to the report the swiss federal council's main focus is on ensuring the integrity and reputation of Switzerland as a financial center and on better positioning the country to explore the opportunities offered by digitalization. Okay, so the government's plan is to create the best possible legal framework conditions so the country can continue to evolve as a leading and sustainable destination of, I mean, for fintech. Um, blockchain and innovative companies in a number of fields okay so although the report discusses the risk of cryptocurrencies being used for illegal purposes like the financing of terrorism it maintains a positive attitude towards the technology noting that the country's laws should be amended to recognize encrypted digital tokens that are not backed by any physical assets okay so the federal council also made clear that it wants decentralized financial transactions to have a place in the legal code, right? So a lighter touch. So the report mentions a proposal to give discretionary powers to the Swiss Financial Market Supervisory Authority or FINMA to loosen regulations affecting decentralized securities trading platforms as long as their activities do not harm investors, right? So this regulatory approach circumvents the current legislation enacted so as to be aligned with the EU's position on the subject okay so Swiss economist Lucius Meiser expressed his belief that this 
um, approach to legislation could prove much more effective in a written statement. So saying, um, this shows once again how the traditional Swiss uh, approach of having having principle-based laws that give a lot of discretion to citizens and regulatory agencies are much more innovation friendly than overly detailed European style laws, right? So that's what she said, or he said rather. So Switzerland has decided to achieve these objectives without creating a slew of new laws, opting instead to adapt current legislation to incorporate new technological developments. So Mattia Rataghi, a spokesman for regulatory matters of the Crypto Valley Association or CVA, commented on the association's stance on these announcements okay so we feel that this approach best represents the principle of technological neutrality and is in line with the position taken by the cva in this in the consultation process so crucially this approach ensures maximum consistency within the current legal framework while keeping it principle based and flexible so allowing changes to be adopted on a need to regulate Regulate um, basis. Okay. So there are also um, proposed changes, uh, right? So Switzerland's Federal Council's report outlines several modifications to the country's laws but clarifies that there are no intentions to immediately change financial or insurance industry related, related laws as it considers that blockchain technology is still in its infancy. So when it comes to these sectors, so the most important legislative changes proposed so far include, so these are the, um, let's check this one, one by one. So amending the collective investment schemes have to include a new type of limited qualified investment funds with the intention of placing future innovative products on the market in a more time and cost effective way. So start recognizing data as an asset by changing company bankruptcy Loss. This would allow Swiss courts to handle and properly distribute digital assets when solving legal, legal disputes. Right? So why didn't the Anti-Money Laundering Act to include the centralized exchanges and allow law enforcement to dispose of third-party digital assets? Okay. Um, creating, a new, creating new authorization categories to give FINMA discretion to loosen regulations for decentralized security traders securities traders and exchanges based in switzerland and lastly amending the financial institution act and the financial market infrastructure law to make them more flexible towards blockchain initiatives all right so what do you think about switzerland's regulatory stance on cryptocurrencies let us know on the section comment section below so that's what they said right so guys um, as you can see uh, Switzerland is going to relax their laws or to loosen up to accommodate blockchain and current crypto startups right so this is very very good news so guys um, I think that's it for today and that are the two updates or the news updates that I share so the first one was monitor you can monitor Bitcoin Dash developments in the Coin Dance tracking page. And the second one is Switzerland is to relax their laws to accommodate blockchain and cryptocurrency startups. So, so there are also other news updates here in PCN today. Here it is. And if you want uh, the news to go to you through your email, just subscribe at preferred currency because daily you will be mailed and the first thing that you're going to see in your newsletter is the news update so if you want the news update to come to you through your email then subscribe now so that is only for 15 dollars a month so that's just for 50 cents a month a day guys so that also includes the spreadsheet of the, of the guru so that spreadsheet is very very informative and very useful so guys if i were you check out preferredcurrency.news and please do watch their videos also here so that you can focus
I mean, you can see, um, you can also see their updates, okay? So I think that's it. And before I go, just a short disclaimer, guys. Um, I'm not a financial advisor, and everything I say here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. So you must always do your own research before deciding for yourself, all right? So this has been Vic once again, bringing you the latest updates on cryptocurrencies today. And guys, please smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. So guys, I'll see you tomorrow for our daily updates. And I think that's it. So bye-bye.